Hello ladies and gentlemen. I'm gonna present you today the flexible such query builder. Uh, it's the library I've developed for usable flexible such query building. But to start with I'm gonna show you that I'm running SAP Hybris Commerce or SAP Commerce Cloud on the 11 version of Java which is really great and makes me a bit more happy in this life hope it works for you as well <laughs> uh, yeah it's uh, the 1905 version okay so let's get started with the usage of the library so here's the short demo I've prepared <coughs> Uh, so to start with we'll write a simple query uh, for searching products by name and uh, to start with you should type uh, for example fsqb which stands for flexible search query builder yeah and uh, to do it of course you need to include it uh, into the libraries of your project uh, I included the library and the sources as well which I highly recommend for checking documentation okay so we're typing flexible search query builder and we'll be selecting uh, from product model I'll using I'll be using smart completion as you see it suggests me uh, only items because uh, it uh, supports only item model types yeah uh, I prefer doing static import so it looks uh, like more readable in my opinion uh, so we're selecting from product table uh, and we have a single condition uh, so it will be condition static import where uh, product model name is equal to uh, static import as well is equal to name and uh, yeah that that's it build so okay I want to use it the the one thing I should add is uh, this formatting I guess because now I'm formatting it manually but would be great if it would format it in the nice way automatically yeah uh, so what we've done here is a simple query for searching by name of course you don't need even a flexible search query syntax to do it but uh, it's rather to introduce you with a simple usage of the library so I hope you like it so far and let's move on to more complex query for uh, finding products by category it's uh, out of the box uh, method I will be overriding here okay so let's check how it looks like in the out of the box and so it's in default product DAO and yeah here is flexible search queries and syntax which I don't like how it's being typed do you like this code I hope you're not and I hope you like how it will be looking after rewriting it okay so let's go to FSQB as well and we'll be selecting the alias because we'll be joining tab tables and we need aliases 
and uh, yeah, we'll be selecting uh, products. So uh, new alias p, p, which I'll introduce into variable. And uh, yeah, I'll add a static import as well. Yeah, then we'll be selecting from. I'll use smart completion as I've noted before, and here you see this single suggestion for me to start with. I'll add static import as well, so we'll be selecting from table product, right? And we'll be product select from product sp and then we'll be joining uh, what we'll be joining let's check <laughs> in the out of the box method uh, so it's the category product relation okay we'll be joining on pk and okay uh, let's move on. So we'll be joining category product relation as uh, let it be uh, R R for relation. Yeah. Uh, I'll add this as a variable as well. R Okay, and uh, we'll be joining on. As you see, it was showing me that it's wrong because my library doesn't allow me to write uh, this. Not uh, like not uh, ended query part. Yeah. Uh, so we'll be joining on p p k and uh, let's see in the out of the box uh, p k uh, l target as uh, er, target yeah and uh, then. Where let's see what what's the condition. So it's a category in in a list of categories. So a source in categories. So where condition. So uh, error source in in I add static import uh, in categories I've already added here above. Uh, yes, and uh, what else do we need? We need to just build this query. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, let's check uh, if there. W oh, uh, we need also to order by name here. Yeah, I'll add it now. So, order by default is ascending if I remember correctly and B field nope product model name yes and just to 
check with uh, with the out of the box implementation. So here's how how it look like in the default product DAO and here here's ho how it looks using flexible such query builder now which one would you prefer <laughs> in your development life I bet you would like to use this library okay and let's move on and just see if it works I've already prepared this small script just to call it and see but first we need to build and replace it uh, need to debug it debug Debug. Yes, I need to remove the bug. And let's rebuild it and replace. Yep, hot swap works greatly without any durable and stuff, guys. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so I'll call it and see what's the output okay search result um, and get result if i remember correctly okay we've got this lazy list and uh, let's open the new tab just to see how how the result will look like if we call default product DAO let's execute it and just compare the results okay we have a different result actually but huh, I guess we need to output something like the case or mm, or maybe I missed something and the query looks different in out of the box implementation uh, let me check it once more okay so selecting from product oh we have one oh no it's just the target yeah. yeah yeah that's why I don't like it it's not readable is it yeah. okay let's just uh, check the query uh, but I guess that something may be different there however it's not very readable and uh, one more thing you should know is that uh, all of the elements except uh, conditions where you put uh, the values in uh, all of the elements are immutable and uh, you may reuse them multiple times you may define them as a constant so for example I want to define this join as a constant uh, Okay, can cannot be refactored. Uh, why? Ah, yeah. yeah. I have performed wrong. Okay. 
No. Wait. Wait. Can be ah okay. It can be constant because uh, because it it uses the aliases which are not constant. But if I would define them as a constant and I would be able to define this one as a constant as well. Okay. It was a short introduction into my library. Hope you like it. Hit likes, do shares and write comments. <laughs> Let me know if you like it. Yeah, see you guys. Bye.